Not terrible where you do that. Hey there, how's it going? Uh, my name is Vlad, and today I'm going to be reviewing the uh, ADA Divine Berserkers. These are their new free ride wheels. I have them in ADA, and um, I'm going to be giving you the lowdown on how they feel on different pavements, on different runs, and throughout their lives. Um, so yeah, I'm going to take these out of the package, give you some specs on them, and then set them up, and kind of get into the review. So yeah. All right, these wheels come in at 70 millimeters tall and 50 millimeters wide. They have a 44 millimeter contact patch when you first get them, which uh, slightly widens to 50 once you get to the widest point of the wheel. Um, these are poured in Divine's uh, Street Slayer Urethane, which is really slidey and really smooth. And um, it's one of my favorite free ride formulas for any wheel I've ever tried before. One of the main features of these wheels is they feature Divine's new core called the Odin core, which is uh, a large spoked core which gives you a uh, much faster roll speed because most of the weight is on the outside of the wheels, uh, which is really cool. It's also a really wide core, which provides the lips to have very minimal flex, making it last longer and be more predictable sliding overall. So yeah, I'm really excited to try these out. And um, yeah, they also come with a stone ground finish, so they're gonna be really, really easy to break in. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna throw these on my board and we're gonna take a quick run. All right, so um, I just finished setting these up right now. Um, I have them set up on Ronin trucks with a uh, 40 degree plate in the front and a 30 in the back on a section 9 arrow. So yeah, um, I haven't ridden them yet, just set them up and I'm going to take a quick run and let you know how they feel. So yeah, uh, currently my knee's actually a little bit hurt so I'm going to be kind of chilling it. Alright, let's do a quick little check just to kind of feel it. Oh geez, that's nice. Take the sidewalk up. Right out of the package, holy shit, so good. All right, chill through this corner right here. Really, really fast roll speed, so nice. All right, so I've taken two runs on these wheels so far, and uh, I'm really impressed with how they're feeling so far. Um, the Street Slayer uh, urethane they're poured in um, feels very, very good. Uh, I've ridden a lot of sets of uh, Street Slayers, and they have that same really predictable slidey feeling to them, but this new core really does make them roll really quick, and they accelerate very, very fast. So yeah, um, they're not even fully broken in yet from those runs, so they're actually lasting a bit despite they are leaving some lines. Um, yeah, they work well at high speeds too for pre drifts and stuff like that, so yeah, I'm excited to keep riding these. Run them jewels fast, run them, run them jewels fast, run them, run them, run, run them, run, run them, run them, fuck the slow mo. Alright, so I've worn these wheels down to about 65 mil or under, uh, so I've had some good time on these. Um, I found out that uh, they're, uh, they're also really good for um, just doing big slides, if you're into that, um, like just to a stop or something, just trying to get the longest slide you can. Uh, they also work well for more technical stuff, such as slide shoves and, and those kind of things, which is cool because it's a really good rounded uh, free ride wheel because you can skate more fast kind of technical runs with lots of turns and stuff, or you can just have fun at your local big slide hill. So yeah, um, I'm gonna keep riding these and wear them down even smaller and then give you my final opinion on them and maybe even core them. And that's why you've done it. I listen, tatted a sentence. 
of my dick last summer Now I'll never get the phrase of my brain, it's no wonder I'm here to buy hearts, I got hundreds Honey, the cheaper the parts, the better buy for the money I'm training for China, whispering, glistening Waiting for the christening I know the neighbors can't help but listening uh, A dirty boy who come down on the side Alright, I've cored these wheels after about three or four hard sessions. Uh, I've had a great time on these wheels. Uh, the one negative thing I have to say about these wheels is when they get really small, like sub 50 millimeters or so, they uh, tend to get a little bit too slidey for my liking. Um, on the runs we were skating at least, I found they got a little bit uncontrollable, but that was just in the last little bit of the wheel, so it's not really a problem. Um, these wheels are also $52. Uh, depending where you get them, they can be a bit more, a bit less. But that's kind of a lot for uh, a wheel that wears down fairly quickly. As I said, I cord these in about three or four sessions. So if you're looking for a really long-lasting wheel that's going to last you a, a month or so, this probably isn't that wheel. But if you're looking for a wheel that is just really fun to skate for all kinds of free riding, different kinds of runs, going fast or going slow, doing technical stuff, or any kind of free ride, I definitely recommend these just because they're a very, very good wheel. Um, you can pick these up at your local skate shop or at resourcedistribution.com. Uh, be on the lookout for more reviews coming soon. Uh, and yeah, thanks for watching. It's Taylor on the cut, lifting six on your stitching crew. I'm miles ahead of you. You can sit my bitches through.